I am Deepal. Today I am going to introduce you Smart Road 2013. Very important and very very useful diagramming tool. Let's go through it. Right. This is the main interface and uh, today I am going to uh, provide using this uh, my main objective is right, very basic idea of this, this software and uh, and uh, let you to know uh, very basic uh, let you know how to use this with very basic example okay let's say this have many many templates you see uh, cause and effect charts decision trees engineering flow plans flow charts mind maps not uh, not only that even for software networking software design timeline strategy and planning wow lot of things actually very amazing software for anyone very easy to use okay i will prove you how to use it very easily let's take a very simple example popular under popular you can see uh, most uh, most of the people generally use items available here you can see uh, in here today I'm going to uh, take example as uh, visual process management right okay in here let's take uh, yeah for easily I take flowchart okay this is the our template actually this is a, actually this is your working area okay and this is the main toolbar in here design insert page table chart picture presentation review even help okay now let's go through it this is you see this is also the uh, very professional way uh, smart draw provide the company you can type your company name i will try my And executed by your name managed by department likewise okay uh, this is the start process and this one you can move on to when you when you take your curse on top of that particular object it will highlight it as a you see put here if you put my cursor on top of that it will uh, yellow color highlighted then uh, uh, pressing your left click uh, left mouse button and you can drag whatever place you want okay now this is the start of the process okay now i tell you very briefly and in here this the this the start then you press this one and just below button also you can use your keyboard arrow keys exactly same functions then if you click this one then alternate process uh, process uh, the, uh, that object is selected and then click on time it come again Still come. Then let's say you want to call the decision, right? Then click one and add. Again, you want the decision, add. Then you want to end the process. Okay, finish. Okay, now let's see how to add a line in between from decision tree to end. Let's see. Okay, let's do like this. Go to line and select shape connector, and then put it in here. Okay, then you go near to it. It highlighted. Then you connect here. And then drag drag and when you come to here where you want to put it just it that's it okay now you want to move it no it's too much closer then you let uh, finish that's true then this is start adding text also very simple because it use exactly same format text format whatever text format you see in here all exactly the same as all automatically you need you do not need to configure it manually, manually. all the things automatically let's say process one yeah. so c e process one likewise to decision one let's say decision one and this is int okay okay now let's say if you want to write down in here something on top of this arrow how to write that one just select and double click that's it my text that's enough okay Ooh. right I made mistake <laughs> okay now you already uh, finished drawing uh, now let's say you want to uh, change the format or color or something and other things okay let's say you want to change the 
like likewise you can change the location also even okay let's say you want to change uh, uh, change the color or something highlight this one and go to here there are so many styles see change another one another one likewise let's say this one and there are so many effects also reflection see oh it's not good it's also not uh, very well <coughs> okay we use this uh, seems to be better state and then okay now we finish drawing actually i want to do it very quickly and you can see then after you draw that one sometimes you may be you may want it to export to word excel or even pdf you see doc ppt or even uh, that means presentation or excel less or even pdf but unfortunately in my machine i installed uh, office 64 bit so it does not highlighted because this particular software does not support office ms office 64 bit version especially 2010 that is why it is not highlighted but if you use 32 bit uh, office it will highlight it and it can be used but unfortunately i cannot show you that one i'm so sorry about that one now let's see how to use pdf one it's very simple desktop tab. test okay it's very fast a few minutes test open you see actually it is very amazing software and hope i hope you learn something about uh smart draw 2013 as well as how to use it and things uh okay let's we will meet on another day uh goodbye